Immigration rights groups turned out in cities all across the country today to support a program many fear could be coming to a close. Deferred Action for Childhood Arrivals, also known as DACA, has provided deportation relief and work permission for young adults who came to the U.S. as children. CBS 13's Carlos Correa is in Modesto, where activists mark the program's fifth anniversary. Immigration groups, including several DREAMers, are in Modesto urging Congressman Jeff Denham, who represents this district, to publicly support the program that's kept them here legally in the U.S. Five years ago, the Obama administration started accepting the first wave of applications from young immigrants for deferred action for childhood arrivals, also known as DACA. Teens and young adults who came to the United States as children but do not have legal status signed up for the program that has given them deportation relief and work permission that must be renewed every two years. The program has been kept in place under the Trump administration, but many worry for how long. Right now, DACA faces a September 5th deadline set by 10 states that have threatened to take the administration to court unless it agrees to end the program. So we're also here demanding that um, our congressional representatives like Jeff Denham stand strong and support this program that's very vital not only to our economy but to the livelihood of these young people. And members of the group have delivered pledge cards to Congressman Jeff Denham's office. They say they will continue to support these young people. Back to you. Carlos, thanks so much for that update. The city of Orville says the department